Japan's nuclear regulator has released a video of the interior of a reactor building at the crippled Fukushima Daiichi nuclear plant. The number three reactor suffered a meltdown and a hydrogen explosion that blew off the upper part of the building. Members of a panel at the Nuclear Regulation Authority entered the building on December 12th. They had reopened an investigation into the 2011 nuclear accident in the autumn. The panel members walked from the first floor to the third through scattered debris. But they could not get to the fourth floor because the stairway had been destroyed by the explosion. On the ceiling of the third floor, they found beams that had been badly bent and air ducts that had been ripped off. The damage indicates the hydrogen explosion on the highest fifth floor or the adjacent area had an impact on the third floor. The panel members observed high radiation levels in some places on each floor. One section of the second floor registered a level of 150 millisieverts per hour. The panel says more decontamination work is needed to scrap the reactor. It plans to continue its investigation and compile a report as early as next year. Workers have finished removing debris from the building's fifth floor. They're now transferring nuclear fuel from a cooling pool in the building to a storage facility in the compound.